Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. It's Villarreal and they take on Barcelona. It's coming up live next on EA TV. A night of excitement stands before us potentially here at the Estadio de la Ceramica, the home of Villarreal. I'm Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box. Coming up from the Spanish top division, La Liga. It is Villarreal versus Barcelona. Yeah, thanks, Derek, as always. Pleasure to be here. I have to say, the atmosphere is fantastic in here. And I'm anticipating a really good game today. Hopefully, we won't be disappointed. Nice and easy for the keeper. The Villarreal starting 11. A towering presence in goal in the person of Geronimo Rulli. Callum Chambers starts with Raul Albiol in central defence. Jean Dolvertu starts with Pablo Sarabia on the flanks. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. It comes to nothing in the end. Now, can they make something happen?
So, he made it look simple, really. Well, the numbers speak for themselves. Barcelona with the best defensive record in the league, and they know how to neutralise their opponents, Lee. Well, Derek, I used to speak to the away fans at Arsenal, and they always used to say to me they felt really confident on the road because we didn't concede goals. There was always a chance, always a sniff of an away day three-pointer. Far from a good pass. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Chambers. It's with Raul Albiol. And a good looking ball. Goalkeeper's ball, the cross delivered too close to him. Frankie de Jong. Hassan. Griezmann. Wijnaldum. Barcelona now in potentially a dangerous position. Well, the keeper committed himself. And Barca's corner. And firing it into the area. Well, he was being very closely marked, but the header not on the target. No, just off target. And the thing is, the defender did his job, and he just couldn't quite get enough of his head on it. Lionel Messi. Must take the lead here. Oh, crucial tackle. Brilliant. Nicolo Zaniolo. Kirk. There's been a goal in the Hitafi game, I'm hearing. Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Hitafi. 23 minutes played. 1 0. Regular updates from Alan McAnally along the way. Nicolo Zaniolo. Asunsao. Nicely cut out. Beautifully disguised ball. Griezmann gets himself into the attacking third with the ball at his feet. It's still there for him. Ronaldo, Terrific block there. And confidently converted. Well, as we see it again, I can tell you his nerves will have been jangling, but he kept his nerve. Really good penalty. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Aviso importante para el dueño de una berlina negra de marca italiana y matrícula. Oh, what an opportunity! And the keeper did more than enough. Trailing as they are, they must make good use of this corner. Just too close to the goalkeeper in the end, wasn't it? Yeah, poor technique, really, and the goalkeeper's not troubled. Messi. Couldn't hang on to it. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? And dispossessed. They all know their roles as they apply the pressure. Well, play stopped. It is a free kick. Well, a little lucky to get away without a card. Might be his last warning, though. And the save made following the free kick, and he was able to hang on to the ball. Useful-looking ball. And offside, just as he was ready to pounce. And threading it forward. Fruitful looking attack. 
Is this the moment? Messi. Credit to them for winning back possession. Already closing him down here. He's lost it. Real chance. And he clears it out of harm's way. Fired over by Messi. Well clattered away. Hassan. Joe Gomez. Wijnaldum. Now Griezmann. Tremendous block. And he takes it on. And that is a free kick artist at work. What a goal it was. Well, here's the replay, and it's lovely. You can't blame the keeper. He can't go early and gamble. It's lovely technique to bend the ball over the wall. It's perfect. Well, a second goal for them here. Gol del Barça. Con el siete, Leo Messi. Well, it's been all Barcelona, hasn't it? It's important to have strong, dominant players in your midfield, and they've got that. Just look at what that control gives you. And that's an important intervention. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. Couldn't hang on to the ball. Well, there... And away they go again. The pendulum having already swung Barcelona's way. Let's see how the second half pans out. De Jong. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Untidy on the ball. Nicolo Zaniolo a very good tackle an encouraging move from Barca and that pass could be troublesome and a goal they're running riot here almost out of sight well let's see the replay and look at the pace at which the counter attack happens and then through on goal do you go for placement or do you go for power well, he certainly wasn't messing around, was he? Absolutely smashes it past the keeper. It's a really lovely finish. Nicolo Zaniolo. A bit sloppy in possession. Vertu. Promising attack, this. And running it back. Well, transfers he's in here can he finish well flinging himself up the ball he's driven in the corner well on the scent of a hat trick but not to be well how many times in the games you get a chance to get three goals not very often he'll be kicking himself there Better two. Gustavo Asuncao. Messi. Now Griezmann. Able to close down the shot. Just found wanting in terms of the finish then. See? And the flag has gone up here, offside the decision. Well, they've decided to make a change. And we're inside the final 30 minutes. Pablo Sarabia. And just slightly offside. Well, there's nothing quite like the magic of the cup and we have the round of 16 to look forward to live on EA TV. It's Villarreal against Real Sociedad. 
Yeah, just 16 teams remaining now, and I think both teams will be looking at that match thinking we're just a handful of games away from the final. Big game, that one, Derek. Pablo Sarabia. Oh, surely not far away at all with the volley. Well, to catch it like that, you've got a really good technique, and oh, so close. Sale del partido con el 23. Hassan moving it forward and putting his body on the line the corner courtesy of Lionel Messi the keeper was up to the task. Well, it's a decent effort, but it's a real opportunity goes begging there. Well, there's nothing quite like the magic of the cup, and we have a round of 16 to look forward to live on EA TV. It's Barcelona against Atletico. Yeah, for me, now starting to get to the nervy part of the competition. 16 teams left in it. Who will last the pace? Can't wait for that, Derek. Better to win it back. Calvin Stings. Teammates in the middle. Fabian. And that will be the keeper's ball. Hassan Martin Braithwaite well he's given it away inside the last quarter of an hour a oh, potential danger had a two a deft clearance Is it going to end up being productive for them? They had a two. And able to get a body in the way. Pretty good reading of the game to win possession back. He's using his strength to good effect. And they could face difficulties here. And he thwarted the attack with a masterful tackle. Hassan, Coutinho, an authoritative challenge. Not a good pass. Well, in the second half here, and it's almost Lee, a case of whatever they've touched has turned to goals. Well, this Barcelona team make creating and scoring goals look easy. I can tell you it's not. It's the hardest thing to do on a football pit. The crossbar got in the way. Wonderful tackle. Well, we both jumped off our seats there, Derek. We thought it was in, but it wasn't to be. Fabian. Coutinho. Goalkeepers have to be mindful that long shots like that can come in. Yeah, I always look at goalies and say, do your job. Keep the ball out the net. Good job he didn't let that one in. Messi. Really needed to be spot on with the challenge inside the box. And that is that, the final whistle. 